Hachapu, Hachapu, Hachapu. Eruna Fair. Eruna Fair. Glad to see you this morning. Looking forward to getting started. So let's get into this adumbration. All right. Keep it simple. Shasha. All over body check in. Standing. Asara stance. We're going to do the form. We're going to go all the way to play guitar like we've been doing. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then we're going to go through the strike with elbow, strike with shoulder, the white crane spreads wings. All right. Going to do that series today. So that we'll end at white crane spreads wings. And we'll do some simple kneeling. Yeah. We'll do some alternate nostril breathing. Wisdom from the sages of the ages. Let's get it. All right. To all the masters that have gone before us, we bow. Teacher to student, student to teacher. Wu Chi. Pyramid hands. And we said we were going to do all of our body check in first. So, y'all, let me get going. Come on now. Come on now. Feet parallel, shoulders with. His hands up, shift the weight. And rotate. Change direction. Set it down on the heel. Wiggle the toes. One at a time, start with the big toe. Working your way down to the pinky toe. Set it down, shift the weight. And change direction. Set it down on the heel and wiggle the toes. Start with the big toe. Work your way down. All the way to the pinky toe. Be parallel on shoulders width. Start with the shoulder. Take it the other direction. And then we start with the other shoulder. All right, and we start with the left hand, tuck that elbow in. And change direction. Change hands. Other direction. All right, we're going to fingers. One at a time. Same thing on the other hand. We're going to fingers. One at a time. All right, and let's get into Wu Chi. Pyramid hands. I'm going to shift that weight. Step left, a little wider than shoulders width. Sit down. Get into the Asar stance. For 12 breaths.
Pyramid hands. Shift the weight to the right, slide the left foot into Uchi position. Dropping the hand, shake it out, opposite hand, opposite leg. All right. Top position. Two breaths. Hands facing forward, two breaths. As we pivot, shift the weight, step forward. Four breaths. Stepping back, pivot, and swinging arms. Let them swing. And we go into stretching the back and opening the chest. Last one. Check it out. All right. We're going to start from feet parallel, shoulders width. Getting into the form. We're going to review what we did last time, which was go all the way to play guitar. Then we're going to review the next series, which is strike with elbow, strike with shoulder into white crane spreads wings. Are you ready? All right, let's do it. Sinking down.
All right? So stay here. Stay with me. Play guitar. Very. Strike with elbow. Strike with shoulder. White crane spreads wings. Got it. All right, so let's get it in. Do it all the way from the beginning. Feet parallel, shoulders width. Sink it down. All right, so we're gonna do it one more time. Sink it down. All right, excellent. So you want to work on that. Now, give some of that simple kneeling. Get on the side. Let's get down. You want to have the toes, heels, and knees together flat. I'm going to bring the body back. And just have a seat. The goal is to get here where the buttocks are on top of the heels. Natural breathing, easy. And again, this is just review because we're coming back to this. Toes, heels, knees are together on the balls of the feet. This is a different stretch. We'll come in again. And we're here. All right. Excellent. Then I'm going to switch to crisscross applesauce for any comfortable sashimi or lotus position. I'm going to go with our half. We'll get to our alternate nostril breathing now. Take that right hand, thumb and index finger, left thumb, middle and index in the center of the forehead, breathing in. Out, in, out, in, out, five rep. Deep breath in. Release. Stand your hands, no breath. Breathing in. Out. In. 
out. And out. Fire breath. Deep breath in. Release. Both hands. Breathing in. Out. In. Out. In. Out. Fire breath. Deep breath in, chin down, release. All right. You can stay in your spot if you want to get a more comfortable spot for our wisdom from the sages of the ages. I'm going to get a little closer so I can grab the books. We can get our read on together. Again, it's something very simple. Old process that we use, one that enables us to clear the mind and also use to answer questions and ponder. A way for you to get appropriate response when you may be beset with challenges and the emotions are unclear and the thought in the mind, the heart in the mind are at odds. Today, we'll start with the Tao Te Ching, the Guiding Light of Lao Tzu. All right. The virtue of benevolence. Hold fast to the great form, and wherever in the world you go, you will meet with no harm, but enjoy security, peace, and well-being. Where there is music with good food, the passers-by will pause and linger. But Tao... On being set forth orally, is insipid and tasteless. It is invisible when looked at and inaudible when listened to. Yet its utility will never come to an end. The essence of Tai Chi, literary tradition. From the five character secret, we get calm. The mind should be calm. If it is not, one cannot concentrate. Once you raise the arm, whether forward or backward, left or right, it is completely without certain direction. Therefore, it is necessary to maintain a calm mind. In the beginning to move, you cannot control it by yourself. The entire mind must also experience and comprehend the movements of the opponent. Accordingly, when the movement bends, it then straightens without disconnecting or resisting. Do not extend a retreat by yourself. If my opponent has strength, I also have strength. But my strength is previous in exact anticipation of theirs. If the opponent does not have strength, I am also without it. But my mind is still previous. It is necessary to be continually mindful. To whatever part of the body is touched, the mind should go. You must discover the information by non-discrimination and non-resistance. Follow this method. And in one year or a half a year, you will instinctively find it in your body. All of this means use mind, not internal force. After a long time, the opponent will be controlled by me, and I will not be controlled by them. In the teachings of Hattah Hattah. When you prosper and establish your home, love your wife with ardor. Then fill her belly and clothe her back. Caress her. 
Give her ointments to soothe her body. Fulfill her wishes for as long as you live. She is a fertile field for her husband. Do not be brutal. Good manners will influence her better than force. Do not contend with her in the courts. Keep her from the need to resort to outside powers. Her eye is her storm when she gazes. It is by such treatment that she will be compelled to stay in your house. Thank you. So grateful for you all to be present today. So now, let us bow out. And we say to all the masters that have gone before us, we bow. Teacher to student, student to teacher, a shame, respect to the ancestors and homage to the eternal witnesses of the earth and sky. I bid you a tap, peace. Had an affair, good day. Aunk Uja Seneb, life, health, and strength. Amen Re Nesutna Chair, Aten Re Neb, and Aunk. The hidden rules the revealed, the revealed rules life. Atipu.